Hey y'all, hey. So happy Mother's Day to all the beautiful mothers out there. I hope y'all have a wonderful day. And I just wanna let you know, if you got a toxic ass mama like I do, you ain't gotta play into that happy Mother's Day bullshit because clearly she wasn't a mother and she don't deserve nothing. I remember my uncle, he gonna talk about something, you know tomorrow's Mother's Day, what you gonna get your mama? He joking and shit, right? I said a bag of shit. He, the, the, the tone of his voice, he was like, what? What did you say? I said, you heard me. I said a bag of shit. Like literally, I would get a, a brown paper bag Shit in that motherfucker. Roll, roll it up like it's a lunch. There you go. Happy Mother's Day. You know, <laughs> that sounds fucked up. But people like her, and again, this is just I, I, I get that she got demons and shit, but I don't think I'm an exorcist. So I need for you and your demons to be over there, over there, over there, because. I'm going to have peace. I'm going to have joy in my life. And if that means I have to keep you out of my life, then I'm going to keep you out of my life. Cause my life, like losing somebody like my mom is a gain. I've gained my joy. I've gained my peace. I've gained my finances. She was a leech and she was draining me of my resources. You know what I'm saying? I was wondering like, damn, why am I broke all the time? Why am I broke all the time? I'm broke because I'm hurt. Still in my money. At the age of 15, I made $3,000 making $6.50 at Six Flags, right? I got to go to this miserable ass. <laughs> I had to go to this miserable ass job. The only reason why I like working there is because I could go and I could go to work whenever, show my uh my badge, get in for free, and ride rides for free all day. And then my friends or whoever came with me can get half price off. So if the tickets is sixty dollars, you paying thirty. You know what I'm saying? So those were the perks for why I liked working there. You know, she was all like, "You need to get." So I was only useful as long as I was making money. Oh, how could I forget? Narcissists believe your money is their money. So if you make a dollar, that's their dollar. I got a dollar, she got a dollar, in her mind she got two dollars and I got zero. How the fuck that work? You know, how does that work? My dollar is my dollar. Y'all know that saying uh, that people would say, what's hers is hers and what's mine is hers. That's a narcissist, folks. That's a narcissist. A female one anyway because to me what's mine is mine what's his is his now if he is a um if he's a generous man then he will be giving you know what i'm saying because let me tell y'all something you know you can't sit there like uh i'm gonna just use an example i'm an earth angel i'm not out here you know doing nobody no harm or no wrong right so for somebody to come into my life and try to fuck my shit up, like, what is up with you? You know what I'm saying? Like, don't get me wrong. A lot of people, they want to feel stupid. How, how did I know that this person wasn't toxic or that they were a narcissist? Because they're charismatic. They're charming. They're likable on the outside, but their insides are rotten. Matter of fact, they ain't even got a heart. Matter of fact, picture your heart. I picture pure-hearted people, good-hearted people to have like a, a, a nice red juicy heart because it's pumping blood, healthy through your body. But these narcissists, these demons, these monsters, these creatures of the night, dark forces, dark energy, they are just dark, heavy, and low. Point blank period, right? These folks, they have a heart, but the heart is black. And it's still, it doesn't pump blood. It doesn't pump blood. They are the real vampires. You know, they're, they're out here trying to find people like us, good hearted people where blood is pumping through our veins and they just want to <laughs> and suck the life force out of you. 
and then your life force enters into their body and now they're they're dark encrusted tar you know cold hearts can boom boom one time two times three times you know what i'm saying i picture them to be like the grinch y'all know how the grinch he got him a real small heart, but then, you know, when he was still in presence and all that shit, all of a sudden it just boop, 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 his heart just grew so big. You know, they have a small heart. But people, but but I love the energy that givers are in right now. They're in a selfish energy. They're focusing on themselves, taking care of themselves. I love it. I love it. You know? But yeah, y'all, I just wanted to just go ahead and put a brief little video out there. Happy Mother's Day to the real, loving, nurturing, caring parents, mothers. You know, I know Father's Day is coming up in June, so y'all have y'all day. And, and, and you know what's real toxic too, y'all, is look, for any of y'all single mothers out there, on Father's Day, leave that for the fathers. You know what I'm saying? You are a woman. It's already bad enough that don't don't be a hypocrite okay is all i'm trying to say we already got transgender women trying to define what a woman is we are women we have titties we have a vagina we have a uterus we have ovaries we bleed every month we and if, and if you're up in age you know you go through menopause and all of that stuff but at the end of the day we are women it's already bad enough that the transgender women are trying to redefine what the fucking woman is. I believe too. No, the fuck you don't. What is somebody doing? Taking a knife and stabbing you right here in your, in your nuts and you're bleeding every month? The fuck is wrong with y'all? Like, seriously, you know? So it's already that women are fighting this battle against the transgender women, trying to call themselves real women. You know what I'm saying? You can be trans all you fucking want, but know your fucking place. You can never bring life into this world. You can never. Because as long as you got them dick and balls, you can only plant the seed. You can't incubate it for nine fucking months. You're not going to push it through a birth canal for nine fucking months. You know what I'm saying? Your body is not going to go through all these hormonal changes like a woman, but you want to call yourself a woman. That shit is crazy to me. But, hey, look at the crazy ass where we live in, y'all. Look at the crazy ass where we live in. So all I'm saying is focus on the women's battle, I guess, you, if that's what you want to call it. You know what I'm saying? Let the men have Father's Day when Father's Day roll around next month. That's all I'm saying. You know, I get that if you are a single parent and, and it's just you because you're dealing with a toxic man or whatever. You know, I'm, I'm very fair. I'm a Libra. I'm fair. I'm never going to sit there and woman bash or man bash. I bash patterns of behavior from men or women. And it doesn't matter your race, your sex, none of that shit. How are you treating people? Period. If you're causing harm, I got a problem with you. Like, God gives us free will to do whatever we want. We can do whatever we want under the sun. But if you are causing other people harm, that's a problem. Period. Point blank. Anyways, I'm not going to run up too long. Happy Mother's Day again, ladies. Go have a beautiful, wonderful day today. Be great. Be aware of people. You know what I'm saying? These narcs be out here narking. We know what they do out here. So all I'm saying is be safe. Have a lovely holiday. And again, if you have a toxic mom like I do, it's okay if you want to give her a bag of shit. <laughs> They totally deserve it because they are bags of shit. And think about it. You know, when, when they say people are full of shit, think about it. Their guts probably truly are full of shit because they don't take care of themselves at all. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, you know, you still have a, a nice day. You know what I'm saying? Hell, if you want to go have your, I would suggest you go have a spa day. If you got time, go do you, go take care of you. And it don't matter if you're a woman or a man. If you know your mama ain't shit, it is what it is. And I stand with you. You know, you ain't alone. But I'm about to have a me a beautiful day. Y'all see, I got my little, hmm, I got my little belly shirt on because it's about to be 100 degrees out in this bitch today. 
Dallas is hot as hell. So, but anyways, y'all, I'm about to go enjoy me some sun and have me a good old nice day. All right, peace, y'all. Yeah, peace, peace, love, and light.